The other day, I saw this suspicious looking guy with a backpack, and something told me to follow him. And I followed him to my customer's house. He was knocking on the door. There was nobody there. He didn't know who lived there. And his story was bullshit. He was just seeing if anybody was there so he can go look around in the yard and grab something. Well, I didn't know at the time. But this guy has been arrested multiple times. He's a drug user. He was evicted recently. And he's been a lot of trouble for a lot of people in the area. His name is Johnny Michael. Now, I didn't, I didn't know all this when I first saw him. And so I ran him off. And still, he's still giving people trouble. After being arrested this last time, nothing sticks or the police aren't doing their job. I'm afraid somebody's going to get hurt. But this guy is bold. He'll go in somebody's backyard, get caught, and make up a story like, I was just looking around, or I'm taking a shortcut, or whatever. Makes no sense. He's going to run into the wrong person. Anyway, here's another picture of him where somebody had their camera set up. He was just looking under the carport to see if there's anything he could grab. Now, he was seen recently, a couple of days ago, walking around with some type of lamps. He was, I think he went through some UPS boxes and took what was inside. He's just looking for stuff to sell for drugs. So this is one of the backyard bandits. Now, this other guy, there's a better picture of him. This man was in his house, and his dogs went off. He let his dogs out. They went right up to this guy, bumped him with their nose. And then the man said, you know, what the F are you doing in my backyard? Because he had to scale a fence to get back there. He said he was working for a, a lawn service nearby. So, you know, at the time, when you're in a situation, you're not thinking clearly. So the man didn't question him on it. Because it, it all doesn't make sense. Because the, the houses on the side of this man had no fence. The guy could have just walked straight through. But anyway, you don't cut through somebody's yard. And the man that caught him said he was shaking like a leaf, but the weed eater wasn't his. So he said, I'm going to get your picture. And that guy being scared, surrounded by dogs, agreed to let this man take his picture. So these are the backyard bandits that are out right now. And people always get caught unprepared. I have a dog. I have a camera all the time. I'm not going to shoot somebody like this. I really have nothing of value. But all of these people that leave their stuff unsecured, they're paying for it. Because these guys will take off for it. And this guy got away with it. This guy with the tattoos, he got a weed eater. Somebody has to know him. Keep your stuff locked down.